Hello all you awesome people and uh, welcome to this video. As you can see, I've been a bit uh, busy. So in this video I'm going to show you what I've been up to with this and also how I finished it. So let's begin. So it starts with the shelf, I just received it and uh, this is how it will look. Pretty awesome in my opinion. And with power of magic, here we have also the glass shelves for it. I put them there, clean it a bit, and now I'm preparing to take everything out of that shelf, uh, which is going to be a bit of a headache. But uh, before that, I have to set this one. I also made some compartments here. Awesome! I'm a close man. Close. There we go. I'm also going to put some LGB strips on it. I'm going to connect it on the old shelf, and I'm also going to put it on from here to here. Here are the canals, or how do you call this in English, in which the LED will go. Now time to put them up. And this is how it looks after I measured it and cut it and sticked it into place. Now all that's left is to put in the RGB strip and uh, now it's done. It's looking very nice. I'm feeling mesmerized by my own work. <laughs> I really like what I did here. I deserve a beer. Also, I put the, the RGB light in here as well. Eh? I can't say that I'm proud of myself. Unlike my parents. <laughs> uh, 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 why do I understand them now? Now I can finally say that it is done. Boy, this took a while, but I'm happy to see it done. Now it's time that I take, well, everything out of that. Oh my god, I'm, I'm already having a headache thinking about this. Sorry about my voice, uh, I had a cold while well, I'm still recovering, but I'm almost done. Imagine the irony, I caught a cold while going to the gym, you know, to get rid of this. And now this week I stayed at home to recover. <sighs> now I have to go to the gym again next week. Well, I'm going to go anyway, so uh, let's begin. And with the power of fast forward, we're gonna, well, fast forward, so we're gonna have to go through all the pain that I have got through. And also, besides the fact that I'm moving them, I also have to sort them. And um, I will take away some of them. Yeah, so basically while I'm doing this, you don't even have to listen to what I say. I can literally say anything here and you will notice because you are paying attention to fast motion. Now it's time to start sorting these older ones. This one, this one I'm going to put it open of course. And with the antenna raised up. Just come on. <laughs> okay. Missing the battery, so yeah. I have to test these two, so I'm going to put them on top of each other. Oh yeah, <laughs> this nice one. I think you remember this one. I'm also going to be putting some extra RGB. Well, technically these light bulbs that are RGB and wireless, I can connect them to the phone and set the light or the light effect for it. Let's open this puppy up. See, compatible with the uh, Hey Google. Oh, the instructions. Well, my being sarcastic, they're really necessary. Mm -hmm. You understand this? I sure did. Here is the inmate. <laughs> it's a bit heavy. I hope it doesn't roll away. Yeah, so I'm putting the box away. And I'm also going to screw it in this little lamp. Because I'm not going to put it in my... 
let's take it out. No need for the warranty instruction, etc. Taking it out of this annoying foil. Come on, you. Some extra foil. Uh, oh, come on, fast forward. Yes. Time to put the bulb inside here, but screw it inside. And the squeaky, 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 come on already. Okay, tight enough. I'm gonna plug it in and just cut it up. Just in it a little. Plugged and the press. It should flicker, there we go. This means that's uh, waiting to be connected. Let's change the angle here. And here is what you see on the phone. I installed the app. I already have uh, one connected to it, because I'm going to use two. Now it's time I connect this one as well. In order to do this, we need to have um, the GPS uh, connected you know, location. It's uh, giving the instructions now on how to do it and it should connect right now. After it connects, it will stop uh, flickering. There we go. Now, we set the name up and play with it as we wish. See, now it's on uh, I set it on cold light, warm, cold again, warm, and I'm going to put it uh, in color gear. See? Well, I still need to do some fine adjustings for this. I don't know what dazzling is. Yeah, some effects here. Back to color four, and let's edit this uh, preference. Let's add some extra color and rearrange them. Something like this. And speed it up a bit. And besides this, I also have to edit the way it changes the color, like smooth, much better, it's looking better already. That's kind of it to the settings, now I'm going to get out of the app and the bulb will remain configured as it is. So there is no need for the phone anymore. There we have it, the bulb it's ready. Alright, so <laughs> I've put a few phones in it, getting there, started to put the Symbian ones up top and I still have, well, all, I'm not going on the top shelf right now because those are the newer Symbian, the N and E series and those are going to remain there, but everything that's down here must go here, so back to work. <laughs> So it's starting to look uh, nice down here and up there, still some phones to be sorted out and now it's time I sort all the N, E, X, C series, all of that will remain in here but first I need to clean inside this thing. So I'll be right back. Whoosh. And this is what I came up with. <laughs> I arranged the phones, the Symbian ones up top, then the newer ones, then the less newer ones, then the older ones, and uh, down bottom, eh, doesn't matter. And here we have the Sony Ericsson and other, ma other brands down, other brands up a bit, the C and X series, the E series, and of course the N series, my favorite, and uh, up on top the accessories. So this is how it looks up close. Only Symbian up here, yeah boy, 
then here are the phones that have, well, the last true Nokia's. Ah, yeah, a lot of phone refurbish. Time to get back to refurbishing, baby. Uh, oh, the, those on the bottom right are for sale. Uh, I don't know when and where, but I may sell them. Also, some of the doubles from up here. Except for N93. I'm not selling that baby. Yeah, a bit of rearrangement wasn't bad. And I had a lot to clean on that glass on which they stand. Not to mention the doors. And look at that big Ericsson. Ugh, my old Samsung friend. Yeah, so this is how it looks ready. And of course, all the phones in the boxes. <laughs> For a nice little touch. I like. Not bad, right? What are your thoughts about uh, my shelves? Oh my god, I've cleaned that freaking window so many times and it's still dirty. I hate cleaning windows. Rather refurbish a Nokia or two. Which I'm about to do in the next days. So this is with uh, what I've been uh, busy over the last couple of days. Been uh, waiting for the shelf and for the windows. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I rearranged them. Up in total, in this shelf and in this shelf, I have uh, 285 phones. I've also taken some of them out, so basically it was around 300. And these are only the phones that are in the showcases. I also have the phones in the bags, eh? and not only there. These phones I'm going to sell, these ones over here, because I have a lot of doubles of them. Even some of those that have four stacked, I'm going to sell three, you know, keep only one. And I'll add some more phones in the near future. Well, that's it for today's video. This is what I've been up to lately, and I'm happy I'm finally done. And it's time to get to work. So, thank you very much for watching, and uh, if you enjoyed it, you know, like always, maybe subscribe, helps me a lot, and, and I wish you a very awesome day just like yourselves, and all the best, and uh, thank you for watching. Bye! <laughs>